Well, good morning and welcome to Coffee with the Pastor. This week uh, we're talking about what to put on. Now, yesterday we talked about that God has told us to live this life in His power and that He's, and we're to put on the armor of God. Now, understand it's God's armor, it's something He's given to us to put on. Paul uses the imagery of a Roman soldier one he'd be very familiar with he grew up with them would have seen them and also they were guarding him probably in Rome when he was writing this but uh, the Roman soldier had certain things and so he uses uh, the uh, imagery of, of a Roman soldier of what we're to put on and remember that yesterday we're to put on this armor because we're in a battle we're in a war with Satan and uh, he says there's some things you need to put on every day to, to, to do this battle. And reading beginning with Ephesians chapter 6, verse 14, he says, Stand firm then with the belt of truth buckled around your waist, with the breastplate of righteousness in place. So you begin putting on your armor of God by putting on a uh, belt of truth. Uh, the Roman soldier had a belt. Uh, they called it a girdle. Uh, most of them were made out of leather, some out of cloth. It uh, is what hooked the breastplate in when they put it on. It also is what they carried their sword, and they had a place for their shield to put on that. But he says that you need to put on the belt of truth first. And one of the things that we go out to do battle with Satan about is truth. Now understand that Satan, the devil, is a liar. Uh, he lies to you. And you have to combat that by knowing the truth. Uh, beginning in the garden, uh, Satan lied to Eve. He said, did God really say? And he started going at the character of God. That is still how God goes at us. He tries to get us to think that God's character is different than he is. He will, get, he will tell you things like, God doesn't really love you. God doesn't really care for you. God's just some cosmic cop up there ready to swatch you around. He really is not for you, doesn't like you. Well, that's not the truth. The truth is that God loves you, God likes you, God wants what's best for you, uh, God is for you, and that's the truth. And so when you start hearing those messages that, well, God's not a good God, God's, you know, like that, that's a lie. Uh, that's a lie from Satan. A lot of people uh, hear these messages all the day to themselves, start hearing things like, I'm not good enough. I'm just not smart enough. I'm not, you, you fill in the, the, the realms on this. I, I just can't. Understand that those are lies from Satan. If you start having somebody attack you, attack you, your character, your personality, your looks, I don't care what it is. You know that's not God. That's Satan. And you need to be armed with the truth. The truth. Uh, he's, he's put you out there and with that. And the second thing he says is that the breastplate of righteousness. Uh, the breastplates on the Roman soldier uh, came in and they protected their heart, their lungs, and their throat. Uh, very essential organs and, and very vulnerable in a fight. And he says, you're going to have the breastplate of righteousness. You need righteousness. And righteousness is being right or right living, moral living, having character. And my best definition of character is what you do when nobody else is watching. Uh, you know, what, what you do when nobody knows, nobody else knows. That, that's your character. And he says, I'm sending you out to battle with your character, with your morality. You see, if you do things immoral, and you if you lie, uh, which is a, you know, that's what Satan does. So you're in Satan's realm if you start lying. 
if you start committing immoral acts, and last week in Colossians, he named some, you remember, sexual immorality, greed, gossip, slander, uh, raging anger, uh, all those things are, are things that, that if you get into that realm, you're in Satan's realm and you've lost. A lot of what your battle against Satan will be and being ready for him, being armed for God, is your character living rightly, living righteously, living that. And, and, and that keeps you, it protects you. It protects you from Satan. It protects you from this world. It protects you in so many ways. So today, as you go out to this world where you're going to be doing battle with Satan, go in the truth. Know what God thinks of you. Uh, when you start hearing those negative messages, know that those are not from God. And go out in moral character. Those things are the things of the armor of God. Those things will protect you in this world. Well, I pray you have a good day. And uh, remember, uh, I'm about to go into my prayer time. I'm going to pray from now till 9 o'clock till when the staff gets here. So if you have a prayer request, uh, just let me know. and just hit, You can direct message me or just put a message on this and I'll look at it because I have a time where I pray for other people during the next hour that I'll be praying. So I uh, hope you have a blessed day and put on the armor of God. Blessings to you.